When we looked at the effect of income on demand, we said an increase in income leads to an increase in demand. We also showed it using a schedule, we made use of symbols, and lastly, we showed the effect graphically. Now of those, I want you to remember three. Words, symbols, and graphs. In words we said, an increase in income leads to an increase in demand. In symbols, we said an increase in income leads to an increase in demand. Graphically, we showed it by a rightward shift of the demand curve. And each of these three methods, words, symbols and graphs, told the same story. An increase in income led to an increase in demand. Increase in income, increase in demand. Increase in income shown graphically by a rightward shift of the demand curve. Now when we look at the other non-price determinants of demand, we're going to use the same three steps. We'll put it in words and in symbols and lastly in graphs. And our check will be whether each of these tell the same story, because they must. Otherwise we made a mistake somewhere.